Today is gonna be a long travel day. First, we're gonna take a shuttle from Ninbin to Hanoi. An hour later, we're here at the Hanoi airport. We are finally boarding the plane. One hour later, we just landed in Da Nang airport. Xin chào from, from the, the beautiful, beautiful place of Hoi An. Oh, yeah. It is rainy today in Hoi An. Just a little spring rain. <laughs> a little sprinkle. And first impression of Hoi An. It's actually very nice. It looks way different than what I thought. I thought I was expecting a small village with not really much to do, but it's actually a beautiful little city with uh, a lot of touristy stuff. There are a lot of really nice restaurants and hotels and spas. Thank you. So we are just replenishing our supplies because I ran out of contact lens solution. We ran out of vitamin C and in this day and age we need vitamin C and we also need mosquito spray. You guys know the drill. First up, we're gonna find coffee because we just love coffee. <laughs> People notice that now that we just love our coffee. So if you guys wanna invite us over, <laughs> make sure you have a good coffee. Me, no English without coffee. <laughs> We're here. Alright guys, so we found our coffee shop and we just literally googled where is the best coffee shop, one of the best coffee shops and this is the most review. We don't know the itinerary today as well. We planned this trip long time ago and we forgot what we're gonna do already. So but luckily there's Google Sheet. There's Google Sheet. We have our Google Sheet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna have coffee now and then we're gonna check out what we're gonna do today. It's rainy, I hope it's gonna hold off, I hope it's not gonna pour, but I'm so excited. Hold on, it's this, it's like first impression of Hoi An, it's like, it's an old town, it's very, it's not busy at all, it's very chill, I love it. Even though it's tailored to tourists, it still has that traditional feeling. Yes, and you look. still see the history, the culture, yeah. I like it, I'm excited. Very nice, so far yeah. of Vietnam, it's my very favorite city. So I got my coffee. Look what it is. It's a Vietnamese coffee and you know already at the bottom there's condensed milk and you know already how strong it is so I'm so excited. Have you got is typical Italian coffee. So it's been 30 minutes you guys and we literally just spent the time sitting down, people watching, watching the world go by. Like I feel like the city, the vibe that I'm getting, it's a lot of chill and you have nothing else to do but just to eat drink coffee and just relax and just enjoy the scenery and the people so we ordered another round of coffee <laughs> and i'm enjoying it i'm loving it it's like for once in our travel we're not running rushing to the next destination i love it it's true it feels like this this town makes you want to slow down and really enjoy things in a different way than a, a big city or a crowded city so probably it's because everyone's walking so slow and they're really enjoying their time so taking their time to walk, see the shops and all that, so it's very nice. By the way, I found the best tip how to drink the Vietnamese coffee. So underneath the Vietnamese coffee, like it's all black, right? It's so strong. But underneath, they put like a layer of condensed milk. And it's very nice. It's very sweet if you stir it too much. So my tip is, instead of stirring it too much, if you don't want it too sweet, just maybe do like, just like this. <laughs> just that <laughs> just to get the sweetness going and it so also it won't make it too sweet hey guys for lunch we are just here after coffee you know what the update is after coffee it rained so we went home to our airbnb i edited a vlog it's uploading in two hours and after that we got hungry because we actually didn't eat much for breakfast we only got donut and that cookie so now we're having lunch i googled again the best restaurants and this is one of the best and it's a great location it's right in the corner of this intersection and it's so nice so so i got bun cha which is a lot of different kinds of meat this amazing sauce i got the authentic vietnamese pancake i think it's an omelet but it's, it looks crispy it described as crispy we got some sauce some veggies oh i think you're supposed to eat it like oh i can't wait i'm excited this is so good delicious this season guys. lunch was great for those two dishes and two bottles of water we paid 400 dong 
and now we're about to explore because it stopped raining so we're gonna run around the city like and, and see how it is so many people here actually are inviting us to go on their boats so i guess that's a nice touristy area to, to go on the boat So we are just walking around the street, getting lost in the streets of Hoi An and it's so nice. There's so many beautiful stores, very unique and it looks like there's a lot of handmade stuff. It does look very touristy, it's catered to tourists. Yeah, definitely. It's very nice, it's very commercial, like a lot of commercial stuff. But you know, once in a while it's nice to see that. It is nice, it's so beautiful, <laughs> it's so colorful. So we haven't seen a single car yet. I feel like Hoi An, or I read somewhere that Hoi An is a city full of walking and bike, motorbike, bicycle, and no car. And after turning around the corner, we end up in this market. Not like everywhere is not a market, but this is like looking like a real, real authentic market. We're still exploring guys. We still don't know where we're going. We're just getting lost day one. So colorful. <laughs> I am so in love with Hoi An. I love the calm, the perfumes in the streets, the, this little rain. It's so nice. Buying your shirt. They don't have my size. Guys, Hoi An is full of shops. It's not even done yet. It, we've been walking every single corner. There are shops. I really want one. I really want one. It's so nice, but where am I gonna wear this? At the beach? Dinner at the beach. I finally found the shirt. They have my size. I'm gonna wear it tomorrow. It's Fabi's turn to shop. Forty, right? I know. Oh, over there. He's been looking for new slippers because just because. <laughs> no, his shoes doesn't walk as well anymore. He keeps on slipping. And his slippers, he's been meaning to throw them away. So he wants a new one. <laughs> he's, are was, you converting? Sorry, was, yeah. You're converting. Oh, the black looks nice. Black or, black or blue, you think? I already see the comments of this vlog. Oh my god, privilege. Rich people privilege. shopping. Rich people. <laughs> Fabio didn't get it. I'm sure we'll find many, many around. We'll come back tomorrow. I found the pair that I like. They just didn't have the size. But I'm gonna get them because summer is gonna be amazing in those sandals. The streets became alive. Looks like they're setting up for the night market. Hey guys, today's video we're gonna show you Hoi An at night. 